Hello and welcome back to GRS F1. Today we are in Albert Park for the Australian Grand Prix. And uh, as per usual, I'm joined by uh, my wonderful partner, Charlie Gordon. Hi. There we go. Um, yeah, we seem to be experiencing some sort of delay. So uh, we'll look Ready at this. Up now. Oh, okay, they're going now. Okay, good. But we will be looking at this beautiful GRS logo while we wait to go. But uh, in the previous two tiers, this is a uh, proven to be an exciting race, as uh, me and Charlie know. F three was a lot, a lot happening in F three, wasn't there, Charlie? Yeah. Not oh, rain. We get. We went from dry to rain to dry. All sorts of carnage, loads of loads of incidents, safety cars and everything. Same, almost the same in F two, pretty much. You know. So we are. Yeah, they're using their tires now. Oh, okay, good. So, hopefully, today will prove to be another exciting race. Yeah, we will be getting under where. Let's see. Will it be raining quality? That would, be, that would spice things up, wouldn't it, Charlie? Yeah. Certainly make things interesting. We Did we have wet quality? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Awful. Yeah. Right, let, let's here we go. Oh. Loading. Oh, that's dry. Boo. It's dry. Boo. But mate, just make it wet, man. We had to experience that. Anyway. Is anyone going to go out? No? No? To plan their setups, I would only assume. And hopefully we get some people going up for quality laps soon. Oh! Well, that's, no idea. That's that's a really good start for um Mal. Is that Malvin? That was Malvin in the McLaren. Yeah, uh, that's the Martin. Sorry. Yeah, that's a very good start, you could say. But Matthew Bailey is the first on track. We will be watching him when he does his flying lap, and we're followed by. Leonardo in the McLaren and then slowly but surely everyone else going out for their outlap. Arjan is racing today. I don't know. Has he raced before in F1 this season? I know he's raced in F1 before. Don't know about this season though. He might have. He may have. Let's... Arjan. Oh, yeah, I am. Um, I'm not. Red Bull. I don't actually know. Mm. I know he's been in it before. I don't know. For the season. We'll see what he can produce today, though. Let's hope it's a good, it's a good, good race for him. Be interesting. I feel really now in the final sector, getting ready to start his flying lap. We'll get the tele telemetry up. We'll see what's happening with all that jazz. And um, there's no nothing else really to look at as he rounds the final corner to start his quali lap. We'll stay on board with him for now. See what he does. Alvin has said that he left to get his Australia set up, which hadn't saved. And obviously, the game just DNF'd him. Just retired so him, yeah. Not the <laughs> ideal start. Damn. Anyway, that's, uh, yeah, that's unfortunate, I guess. But at least he'll have his set up for the sprint. Yep. Why would he have to leave for that? Because uh, I guess he went to go get them off time trial, maybe. Hmm. Yeah, but surely if they're like, if you already got them saved. Ah, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Anyway. Well, oh. you might 
I don't know. Is he gonna get blocked? Is he gonna get a toe from his teammate here? I don't know. He was he was very close behind his teammate. He might have got a toe there, but as Matthew Bailey, he's entered the third sector of the track, and he seems to be going well so far. The round to the last couple of corners, round the penultimate corner he goes. Coming up to the final corner now. Let's see what he sets. Up the pit straight to the line. And it's going to be a 1-17-2. Respectable lap, I would like to say. But we'll see what everyone else has to say. Especially Leo as he rounds the final corner. Is he going to set a quicker lap? Up to coming up to the line now. It's a 1-17 wash. Yes, he does. Uh, who's next? Who's next? It is Luke Mills. He comes across. Third, 117.2. That's an all right, all right. First lap. We've got, uh, oh, is it Twan? Oh, people invalidated. Mm -hmm. Twan's just crossed the line. Gone P3. Gone ahead of me, Luke Mills, on his first lap. And, uh, yep. Yeah, good first lap for him as well. Is it? Alfie Harvey next. Yes. The ABC, sponsored by GRS Driver, goes fifth with a 117.3. Very close. Very oh. close. Very close qualifying right so far from the top five, as you said. Oh, we've got an LP of Dino. He's on a flyer. 117.3. Still very close. Very close between the top six. We now have the Hass of Bello, who I think is also going to set a similar lap as he rounds the final corner. Let's see what he says comes across the line. Going to be a oh, 116.9. Go on, Bello, son. He takes. Nice. Yeah, Callum is going to come across the line next, but Bello taking pole position. That's very nice for him. And Callum goes a 117.3. Still very close. Goes P6. Moving Alfie Harvey He's and Dino down. Similar times to the front of F2 yesterday. Yeah. 17 2 threes. Yeah. But Bello breaking into the 16s. It's amazing. Here we are. Arjun on the lap. Yeah. Is Arjun. he the next? Yeah, he is. He is the next, I do believe. Rounds the penultimate corner. Going up to the final corner. Comes around the final corner now. Let's see what he sets. Would he set a similar time to the rest? Be close. Within like a tenth. And it's going to be a 169 just behind Bello. Goes P2. Maybe like, that's, that's like three hundredths behind Bello. There's only a small amount of time there, but that's very close. Love this. Mills go sixth. Hmm? Luke Mills go sixth. He was already sixth. Was he? Yeah. He, he was like he's one just of crossed the line, so... He no, he's, he's on a... Lap. Maybe he already... No, because that, that's the lap that he set from his first. That was his banker lap. First one. I think. It's gone again, then. Oh, yeah, probably. David Hoy. I think... Did... So yeah, Luke's pushing. He's going again. Yeah, yeah, he is, yeah. Maybe he just started his flyer. I think he just started it. Yeah. Anyway, if he has just... He's gone purple sector two. Gone he's definitely on a flyer. One two. Yeah, that's... He's going for that pole position early. He doesn't he doesn't want to leave... Oh, he slides a bit. Going through that corner. He backed off? No. Mm, I don't think he has, but he did slide a bit. Let's see. As he's going up to the final corner now. He goes into the pits. He backs off. Yes, but David, David Hoy next. is on a lap. Yes, as you said, he is going up the pits right now. What is he going to say? I think it's going to be number 117. 117.5, a bit further back, but still quite close. Uh, next, there's not actually many people on the lap. Uh, Roswell. Oh. Roswell just starts for that. He's invalidated. Yeah. Uh, Otto. He's that. invalidated. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But Roswell... He's on a flyer. He's the only... I think he's the only one on the flyer right now. Yes, he is. And so we'll see what he does. Will he set a purple sector one? Well, as it comes across... Going to come across the sector line now. Purple sector one. Oh, here we go. Washwell is cooking. Otto's going again for a natural lap this time. Okay, that's very good. As he comes down this straight now. Up to the second... Up to the exit of the second sector, into the third sector, and he goes purple too. Rushwell's gone purple too. Okay, okay. 
Coming through the third sector now, third and final sector. He could be on for a pole lap. Going for a pole time. Going through the last final couple of corners now. Round the penultimate corner. Through the last corner onto the pitch straight. Will he set a pole time? Let's see. Comes across the line. It's no. He lost it in the final sector. A 117.6. I wonder if that was a glitch. Him having the purple sectors. Or if he just yeah, lost it in the be. final sector. Well, the game's got us all. I was excited then. I thought he was going to, you know, set up a pole lap. But no. No, he's, uh, it's the game. The game's ruined it for us. But Otto is obviously on a lap. As he comes through the final sector now. Round, going to round the final corner onto the pitch straight. Will he set another quick lap as he previously has done in other races? Hmm. 117.6. That's not uh, what you expect from him, to be honest, is it? I think Matthew Bailey's on a lap. Matthew Bailey's going to cross the line. Two tips quicker, 116.8. And I think Callum's on his out lap. Okay. But Matthew Bailey Next does go pole. Villius. Villius. Okay. Yes. Le Manas, as he is called in the game. As he's going to round the final corner. Good on the throttle. Coming down the pitch straight now, I think he's on for a. All right, that. He goes for a 117.4. Yep, pushing him up to P10. Who else is coming across the line? Uh, Alfie Harvey's on the out lap. Is it Luke? Leo is... Yeah, Leo. It's Luke. Leo, he uh, is. Yeah, yeah, know. you're right. Yeah. No, Luke was on the out lap. 116.8 goes. Oh, yeah. Only 4,000 to the second. 4,000. That is. No. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're yeah. correct. I don't yeah. know. Maths. And that. I think Alf Did Alfie Harvey just set a 116.9? Um, I think he just did. If he did, he's pushed up to fourth. Uh, Bello started a lap. Who's... Alfie Harvey's on the 17 throw. I think at the moment. Callum's down on his time. He's... Well, the game says he's down on his time. I don't know if he is. We'll see, though. As he comes down the pitch straight. Yeah, he is. He's still down on his time. Purple set to three, though. I don't know if that's true. If the game is having another bug moment. But it might be. Alfie Harvey was up on his time at the end of Sector 2. Yeah. Let's see if he's going to do any major improvements. Rounding the final corner now. What can you do, Alfie Harvey? Can you set a pole time? Can P5? 117-1. By the way, I was looking at Arya and I thought I was Alfie Harvey for some reason. Don't know why. Yeah. Uh, Anybody else in that? Bello. Bello's on. Bello, that. yeah. Let's see. Will he be able to claim pole position back after the. He go oh no, he spins, oh, he spins out! Oh, that's unfortunate. He's just. I think he's just. He's got a too aggressive on the throttle there, hasn't he? And he's just. Sadly, he's just gone. Could be on lap there. Hmm. Otto, yes he is, he's rounding the final corner now. Ooh, oh, a bit of snap. God. A small snap there under traction. Let's see, will that affect his lap? Yes, yes it yes. will. Yes, it will. But I think an Alpine. No? Everyone no, coming in now? One Alpine. I, don't think, I don't think everyone's on lap. Everyone's going into pits now. But, uh... Got Twan on an out lap. A couple mm -hmm. people starting to come out now. Interesting strategy from the Alpataris. Maybe just saving tyre. Team of Games and Oscar not going out. I think that's what it is. Obviously, Sprint Weekend, you, you, you have less tyres. I think. You're probably going to use a set of mediums or softs in the, in the sprint. Otto's so, only half a tenth down. Mm, like oh, he might be going again. Iron just invalidated. I don't know if he was on a lap as well. No, but Otto. Yeah, I don't think Otto's going to improve. He's pushing, but he's out of ERS. Yeah, that's not good. ERS, in quality, out of ERS, like, it loses you so much time. You just lose tenths as soon as you get on any sort of straight. Uh, I think he should be pitting, really. No! Oh, he spun! He's oh, out! He he's done. hit the wall! 
Now, is he going to reverse to go into the pits? Yes, he is. But that is unfortunate. He's lost his wing. Not what you want to see. Almost, almost going out there. Is that uh, anyone? Is that Rodwell? Twan. Rodwell's on the lap. Is Twan on the lap? No, Twan's on his out lap. Twan's starting his lap. He is now on the lap. But his teammate, Rodwell, is indeed on the lap. Has he entered sector? He's entered sector three now, and he's uh seems to be going all right so far. I haven't seen the rest of his lap, so I don't know what he could be on. Oh, a bit of a bit of bit loosey on the curb there, as he's going to round the final corner. He's going into the pits. Clearly lost his time, but Tuan, as you said, yep, yeah, he's started his final lap, and he's currently on it. Going down the back straight now. Rory's might be working together. Ooh, what are you reckon of giving him a bit of a toe? Is David Hoy on the lap? Yeah, Luke slowed right down. And David Hoy is on the lap. He's giving toe. We'll go back Let to Twan. Through, so, yeah. yeah, we'll go back to Twan. He's almost a tenth up. On board. Ooh, five place grip penalty for. What, Alfie Stop Harpy? Bobby, like yeah, illegal blocking though. Oh, he, he is blocking. Juan, he's going to set a 168. Goes pole. Pole position for him. Only by 3,000. Oscar's retired. Why is Oscar David Hoy comes across the line. Oh, David Hoy. He's down on this time. Can he oh, no. Three yes, times he up. Can. 117. It goes just above his teammate. Respectable. He might be giving a toe. I don't think he can. He got the two Williams in between. But they might move out the way, although. Oh, Callum! Yeah, there we go. Oh, that was a bit, bit close for Callum, though, isn't it? Wasn't it? You know, yeah. Yeah. Although we... it surprised me that they went to the outside line where the racing line would be. Hmm. If we've learned anything from a, uh, you know. Fernando Alonso in real life that if you get that close dirty yeah, you know it could wipe him out he could have been in the middle of the track screen for a red flag yeah so. oh he's gonna get a toe he's gonna get a toe beautiful toe beautiful teamwork from the two Ferraris there coming to the very fast pace chicane now purple set two three temps up Blue Mills he could be on for a, a really good run here yeah there is a restart after yeah. Uh, there will be a restart, yeah. Mm. Just extending. Well, not extending. Illegally. Using as much track as he possibly can, Luke Mills. Seems to be flying, to be fair. I'm loving what I'm seeing right now. As he's going around the final corner, I don't know if anyone else is on the lap in front of him. No. Going up to the line. Is he going to set pole? Will he set pole? Yes, he will. 1 16 7. Bye. Bans retired? In the pits. Okay. Bye. 1. A bit more than one tenth, just over one tenth, pretty much. But finally retiring, thinking his lap is uh good enough to keep get him a good position. Probably also saving tyres. Uh, Luke Mills going P1. Let's see if anyone else could answer to that. Alfie Harvey will be next across uh, the line yeah, yeah, to yeah. finish a lap. Yes, he will. Good, good corners. Mafia Harvey so far. The ABC sponsored by GRS Driver. Rounding the final corner. Will he get pole position? We'll see. We'll see. As he comes across the line. Oh, no. But he does get a 169. Pushing up to P5. Very close. A tenth behind Matthew Bailey. Pretty much. Like, if he got a tenth and a bit, he would have been in P2. But still very close. Anyone? Dino crossing the line. With a 1, 17 1, sending up to P8. That's good positions for him. Oh, he's on the lap. I think he might be the next one. Ayan is on the lap. He's down. five seconds I down. Think he though. was, wasn't he? Yeah. Uh, you said Le no. Um, Hoy, David, David Hoy. Hoy. He's going across the line. Nah, he's backed no, off. He's backed off a bit. Who's Callum? It's Callum. Or has he started it? Uh, Too many drivers across the line at this. What, what is happening? I think Matthew Bailey. Round in the final corner, he is... No, he's backed off. 
Hmm. Strange there. But I think Timo. Oh, he was he's like he was out on track with no time. By the way, Roswell's set a purple set to two. I've just seen that. Uh Bello. Hello about cross the line. Yes, he is. Will he maybe fight back for pole? Let's see. 168 seconds. Almost. Yes. Very good lap though. Very good lap. Not pole, but very good lap. Pretty much dead. Oh, and Iron hits the wall. He's already yeah. invalidated, but he still hit the wall. That's big. But Roswell, who was on the purple set to come across the line. Mm, 117.4, not much improvement there, sadly. Callum's down on this time by about a tenth. Oh dear, that's not what you want to see. Is anyone up on that time? Is it Mills up on it? No, he's not going to be. David, is not. Callum, you said he's not. But the man has his pit in. Didn't... No, Callum was close. He might pull it back. Not Ooh, like that, he won't. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, Callum, that was so not right. Dave Hoy. I think that's it. Yeah, I, I think that is it. You think you're correct. Dave Hoy yeah, enjoying his life. Hmm. David Hoy just enjoying his time and he's retired. Very nice helmet. Not with that logo plastic on top of it though. I'm apologising for what happened with Luke on the straight, although it didn't seem to really affect anybody. Mm, you might have been giving him toe, to be honest. Yeah, I mean... It might have helped. I'm just going to flash the quality green so that uh, they can get it. Are we leaving, or is it just they're going to retire? I have no clue. I've not been given any information yet. Would be nice to know, though. Wink, wink, admins, wink, wink. You know, I'll use this um this false session to practice. They're leaving. They're leaving. I'll still use this to practice my uh race start. Oh, they said retire on the grid. Oh, uh... they say retire on the grid. Yeah, it takes so much longer to invite everyone back. No one listens. Yeah. Oh, he's retired. They yeah, said everybody leave now. Oh, okay. Well, they said never mind, everybody left. And we're migrating host. Can we. One, two, three, but we might as well leave, to be honest. There's no point. Uh, playing. Well, we actually we could if they're going to use the same lobby. Who's hosting? I already left. Yeah. Well, if it's just me. Yeah. It literally is probably just me. Life of five red lights. Here we go. It's. Lights out and away we are racing in Australia. Everyone going up, yeah, blah blah blah. And uh with the main menu, mate. Boring race, boo. Hello, mate. Calm it. Calm it, mate. Always got a beef in commentators chat, yeah? Right? What's he saying? He said mid comms. Whoa. Oh, much better than yours, bloody fruit juice, mate. Ah. Oh. Honestly. He's still saying mid comms. He's spamming mid comms. Get points, then you can talk, mate. Wee, I'm joking. Uh, mid com. Love me some black current. I personally think orange is better than black current, but I still do like black black current. That's, that's, that's a what? That's a strong take. I just personally enjoy orange more. It's got a bit more of a. I don't like orange. It's got a bit more of a, I don't know, like a, a hit. It hits you more, especially when you put more in. I like a strong. I like a strong squash. 
If we're talking, oh, I like orange. You just taste bad. In if my we're opinion. talking, um, fruit, fruit juice. What if I just blanked? What if I just? Oh, looks like a wet race. A wet race. What? Yep. Are you in the lobby? No, that's just what was said in chat. Oh, they, there was like rain in in the middle somewhere. Uh, was, yeah, I said into to dry race. But it was dry at the start of the race. It it was. No, it starts into and then gets dry. No, it was it was dry at the start of the race on the race start. That was sprint. Oh yeah. Did it make? Keep forgetting. Um. Hey. I I I indeed. What was that old thing? That uh. That company. You always feel like when you're like four or five, you went to a bar. You'd get like those. More plastic bottles. Fruit shoot. Fruit shoot. Brilliant drink. Uh, that that I prefer black currant. Yeah. Love fruit shoot. Look at that. I'm not going to look at that website. Shit. Oh. Pardon my friend. Um, let's look at the standings. Is the lobby up yet? Um, I haven't got an invite. Have yeah, I got an invite? I have. No, if I don't. Cheers, lads. Very good organisation. Um, actually, I can just join off Matthew's profile. Well. That is the tier three. That's the tier three stand. Uh, here we go. Here are the tier one standings. You can have a look at them. Oh, wait, actually. Quite a bit good. Uh, oh. Oh, oh, whoa. We're back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Standings. Here. Yeah, cool. Luke Mills leading by a landslide. He's he's ahead by like pretty much two race wins. Crazy, Matthew, Et Prime, the P four merchant so far. He got one P. He got P five in Austria. Then it's ever since it's just been P fours, and he's second, even though he's only had. He's not had a podium yet. He's had a podium. First, where he can't get a podium. Oscar, not obviously, he was uh, not in Austria. He wasn't in the league for Austria. Got the race win in Imola in his first race. GRS, maybe. I don't know. Uh, and then he DNF in Canada. Obviously, there was an incident with Bello. It was his fault, though. And then there was a... Well, okay, the steward said it was his fault. I don't know. I'm biased. Uh, well, I'm not biased. I'm in, in the middle, in it on the fence. And then... Miami, he's got a good P2 with Luke Mills finished ahead of him because of uh, some penalty, penalty, something happened. It's still a reserve though, so. Yeah, yeah. But If anybody drops out, he is definitely the... Hmm. I'm just going to quickly uh, just look at the fact that he's TTM there, TTM there. You maybe think there's a bit of a correlation. We don't know. Um, fourth is Otto with a P2, P3, P7 and a sadly DNF in Miami. Had an unfortunate race then, but his teammate had the right race. Look about his teammate. Where is he? Oh, he is a reserve. I thought he was a permanent Mercedes driver. Oh, is he? Vigo. He's a reserve. I thought he was a permanent just... Mercedes driver. Always happened. Oh, I got an invite. Oh, did you? Oh, I forgot to invite you. I'm sorry. very sorry. Wow. Well, we got Connor Hawking in the chat. Matt had a stinker. Speaking of Matt and Pal talking about juice, you're sat there showing fruit shoot. Yeah, yeah, but that's because we were on the conversation of juice and we were in the middle of 
re-lobby. Did you show a picture of Fruit Shoot? Yeah, I did show a picture of Fruit Shoot. <laughs> Why not? Right. A bit of entertainment, yeah. considering we are, um, yeah. you know. Oh, we're up, people. Don't look at Fruit Shoot, Fruit Shoot. We're up, people. Is there more people than there were? Six, 16. I don't think we had 15 in quality, didn't we? Yeah. I don't know. I can't remember. Let me just look up and watch it. Is it just me, or have the names changed? So, Otto, Alfie, Harvey, and David Hoy all have ABC sponsored by GRS. Look at that. Is their clan now? Is that just my game? Uh, oh, Alfie, Harvey, Otto, Otto, Otto already had it. David Hoy. And David Hoy already had it. I thought he just had GRS. I'd... No, Team GRS Definitely doesn't exist there. anymore. I know, but it just it wasn't showing the whole thing for me in Quali. It doesn't show David. It doesn't show David's for me because I changed his name to just Dave. I changed his nickname just to David Hoy. So when I'm commentating, easier. Right. Yeah, I think Black Cut Fruit is the best. Would you agree? What do you mean? What is this comms? Currently, we're re lobbying, so we've got to talk about something. And we've already looked at the standings. Who oh, P A? Oh. Yeah, P A. It's spicy. 11 gap, 11 into Alan Morris. Watch well. He's got. No. no. It's a two gap interval. More incorrect. Two gap interval. Two point gap. That's a. Obviously, there's 11 point gap. Vigo for Watch well. And last with Callum Lyons. He reserved. Sadly, he's in last with Tyler above him. He's also in. Right, they're pretty much just in last. That's what happens when you're from F2, mate. Uh, I'm joking. John Ahern and Marco, they're all pretty much last. He should realistically be last because he... Mar Marco, you should realistically be last because you DNF'd. That, that's what realistically should happen there, and they should be above you because they didn't DNF. Marco? Yeah, I'm looking at the F2 stands. Ah. Uh. They're, they're all four F2 drivers. Was John, Marco, Tyler, Callum. PM. Realistically, you should be last, Marco. I'm sorry to say. Ribena. He's put... Connor just put Ribena over Fruit Shoot. Wow, ah, well, that's a... That's a poor take. That is bad. Ribena's overrated. Mm -hmm. What about a cheeky Vimto? Not a cheeky Vimto. A regular oh, Vimto. Vimto. Oh, a regular Vimto. We'll talk about a regular Vimto, not a cheeky Vimto. Do you know what a cheeky Vimto's Vimto is? Vimto's good. Neither. Alcoholic beverage. Oh, it's not even got Invimto in it. It just tastes like it. Apparently, oh. just, just straight vodka with just a shot's worth of Vimto. <laughs> no, that's 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 a that's drink. That. Again, well, I don't know. They've raced more. I, they should be last as well because they finished. They haven't finished. These Donnies haven't. Jensen and Aryan haven't finished. Why are they above Cal? I'm sticking up for my Alpine boys in F2 here. They should not be last. Should be Marco. Then Aryan and Jensen. And then Tyler Callum above them. Actually, right. hang on. We're ready. Anyway, uh... We're going. We're going. Okay, we'll leave this. Quickly have a quick look at the constructors. Ferrari running away with it. Running away with it, sorry. Uh, McLaren, right. they're they're close, but the it is closer from P two downwards than it is from P one to P two. There's a thirty seven point gap there, and there's nine point gap to McLaren from Williams, which is you've got you've got a few majority of the points coming from Matthew Bailey and Callum Morris dipping in out dipping in and out. He obviously didn't race in Miami, he doesn't contribute to his points total from there. And these ones he does. Anyway, yeah, we are. Have we gone yet? Or are we still in lob? Alfie Harvey has asked for um, no making fun of him. Uh, uh, since when? No promises. No, yeah, no. Is he added us an F1 chat to say that? Yep. Well, <laughs> when have we made fun of him? When when have we ever made fun of him? Have we? Starts probably now. Yeah. You know, Alfie, you just didn't have to mention it. 
because now we are gonna. But, but here we are, as you can see, you've got some. Oh, look at that guy, he's very happy. Look at him above the Red Bull box. Look at him. Oh my god, yeah, he's... he is. Chuffed. He is excited for this one. <laughs> just <laughs> look at him. He's so happy. Yeah, he is. <laughs> the other one as well, both yeah, of them. They're all look at that one's facing backwards above the Ferrari garage. Look at him. He's facing backwards. And he's what is he what are you cheering up, mate? What is, what, what is blood looking at? That's crazy. To be honest, the guy the guy above um Alfie Harvey's garage is like he's like looking diagonally he's looking at the window he's looking at the window post yeah <laughs> and the one above Argent's keeps phasing through the background yeah man. <laughs> look at that they've got a bench in there what else they got in there they've got a bench and some pillars are they prisoners i mean oh maybe. it doesn't matter oh, anyway. go. one two three four five red lights it's lights out and we are racing in Australia with Luke Mills getting a not good start, but we've also got Bello right on the back of him there in P2 as he go into turn one. It seems all clean. Oh no, there's a bit of contact in the back there between I think maybe an Alpine and a McLaren as we move back. They're very close back here. Oh my god, I'm watching this. What's gonna happen? He gets close. Oh, they're three wide. They're four. They're five wide. What is happening? There's a bit. Oh, pushing and shoving. We got a five-second penalty. Three-second penalty. Penalty's been chucked around. Is everyone out? There's a retirement. One's out. One is out. We missed that crash because oh, it was up wow. ahead. You got there. I think that must. That has. To, wait. What corner is that? I think he spun out That's... that corner. Yeah. He, he had to so. touch the inside curve. But Twan, who was one of the quicker ones, you have to say in this session, is now out. Unfortunate yeah. for him, especially to happen on that one in the sprint. He's going to be last, unless someone gets disqualified, of course. But that probably won't happen. And we've got possible race strategies. We've got uh, medium tires with zero stops, or hard tires with uh, zero stops. Believe it or not, I thought they were going to. And yeah. Lamanas or Villiers is on softs, and Timo Games mm. on hard, but everybody else is on mediums. Yes. That. That safety car might be good for Le Manas, you know. Might be good for Villiers. Might be able to pit. He might be able to pit or he might you be able to just save his tyres. He should probably... Oh, a couple of people are pitting. We've got all that Callum's in. Hmm. Um, he doesn't pit. Uh, we've got that Villiers Malvin, Alfie Harvey, uh, Otto's in. No, he's Gee. not. Oh, yeah, we've got uh, Malvin. He's getting a new wing. Oh, a lot of people in. Mm, there must have been a lot of contact. They, they were all like five or six wide at one point. Dino's in as well. Like, it's crazy how you can fit five cars alongside each other. Yep. Callum's last. Has he been And jumped? those are the five cars right there. Yeah. Got some ghosting. Obviously, people coming out very close surprise, together. Surprise. Surprise that um, uh, Arjun didn't pit to try and get rid of that uh, five, five seconds. seconds. What is it for, though? Because doesn't it depend on what it's for? If it, can you just get rid of it? It was thing? for... You can just get rid of five seconds. It was, but it was for overtaking two cars off track. Oh, uh, okay. Bit of chaos. I think in the next game they should add it to, like, you know, lap one. If, like, you've done maybe a corner, you know. Be a bit more lenient, can I? Lap one. Especially if we're in, like, five lap fight, like... You're in traffic and there's like 10 cars ahead of you, or you know, you're like five wide going into a corner. Yeah. Crazy. Anyway. Luke Mills now leads the safety car. Not many position changing. Not many position changing. Just. Uh, can I speak English? Not many. Oh, wait, hang on. He gave it to David Hoy. Changes. Not, yeah, yeah. At the back, especially. Top. Top three, I think. Top four stayed the same now. I believe. Uh, top top two stayed the top same. Top two stayed the same. And Matt Bailey. Oh yeah, because he... Five. Five. And Iron's up from P4. Uh, Iron's up from... P7, P7. sorry. P7. Yeah. And Leonardo Teresi going down one position to P5. 
Unfortunate there. You've I think he was up into third at one stage. Though. Yeah, yeah. Until maybe some cheeky contact, cheeky moves. You know, lap one, crazy. Lap one and lap, lap one and the last lap. You always see crazy moves. Dude, Bailey trying to get alongside Bello there. Ooh, that could he be a penalty. But he was very close. If he does get, if he ever does the, go alongside him, it could be, you know, cheeky pen. Well, I'm bored already, but that's only because of the safety car. It was very exciting seeing all the action, the the five wide cars, the like you know, going into the chicane, yeah. five wide. You love Everybody's to see it. Everybody's caught up to the safety car. Yeah, it, might it be should in be in. It, I hopefully wish it. I wish it to be in. Get some racing. We don't want a sprint race that is just taken up by safety car because you know it might help with the tyres not wearing, but at the same time. We've got people to entertain here. Should announce it soon. Yep, there it is. It is in this lap. It is in this lap. We will be racing at the start of lap four. It will be the start of lap four, won't it? Yeah. Yes. But the question is, when will Luke Mills go? This is a really good camera angle. That camera angle is really good, Ooh. you know? Anyway. Yeah. I'm going to put the telemetry on just to make sure we know when he's going. Here we go. He, he's currently keeping it at a steady 50, maybe 60 miles per hour. Bailey, very out wide there. Mm. I think he needs to be careful. He could get a penalty. Being back in now. Oh, that's a... oh, it's a spin. He's just lagging and spun. Yeah. He's, anyway, he's Lou Mills is gone. Lou Mills is gone. He's, he's he gapped. Dropped, he has dropped, I think. I think Bello might be distracted by the, the carnage behind him, but yeah, he has absolutely dropped him there on that restart. Nobody really close together here. No, they're all... Oh, except yeah. for... What was that? That's Albie Harvey and Malvin side by side into turn one. Oh, they are just being contact and it pushes. I think he pushes Alfie Harvey off the track. He has to give the position back so he doesn't get more penalties. We didn't get a penalty, but unfortunately now he's alongside with Dino. Into the chicane. He's got, I think he's going to get moved on. He's got the inside line. Yep. Yep. He makes sure that he defends that position. Unfortunate. But now he Dino's... Malvin's going to give it back. But it doesn't look like he is. No. I don't know. I don't think he will. I don't think he's been told to give it back. So why would you? But Dino is very close. He's going to... Oh, Callum's also there. They're go, they're, I'm going on board with Callum here. He's right behind this. No, he's ahead. He's ahead of Dino. Is he going to get both? Oh, to the this go oh, yes, yes, he does. Switch back from Alfie Harvey. Oh, Alfie Harvey, he's, this is very, very good battling, very entertaining battle. And when he get the move round the outside, no, goes wide. But he was, a f I, I feel like he would have been afforded enough room to stay on track there. But yeah, Callum seems to be, sec have secured that position. As Luke Mills claims fastest lap of the session. 1.19.3. Oh, David Hoy steals it while he's on the soft tyres. He pit for softs. Yeah, you probably would, to be fair. Yeah, I really would pit, pit for softs. Mm. He's like Bello. Being overtaken by Matthew Bailey with a move into the chicane. And he's going to keep it from around the very fast. Oh, he's touched the curb there. I don't know why they touched the curb. It's not ideal to touch it. Touch the inside curb. You shouldn't do it. Maybe on this one, but on the one out... On the exit of the chicane, you should just stay off it and go flat out. But, that's fine. They've managed to do it all right. Ooh, Phileas. I think he's looking for a move on the straight, actually. No, he's not. He was close, though. He's very close. Almost one and a half tenths behind. Loses a bit of a time going through the chicane. A bit slow on the accelerator. But... Oh, Callum, together. Callum, yeah, Callum's sorry. going for a move. Ralph Malvin gets pushed wide, but managed to keep it calm on track. Will he be able to... Oh, very good defensive move there from Malvin. And we got Oscar going down to P8, overtaken by David Hoy on those soft tyres. He's going to be flying. Well, yeah. DRS is enabled. We're going to see a lot more now, DRS being enabled. We're going to, I'm going to put the... Fire detail on. 
the, we'll have a look. Bit of a train forming behind Matthew Bailey here. Yeah. See, uh, DRS is gonna. Oh, and there you go. MBI. Luke Mills. He's gone. We've got some. We've got Alfie Harvey. Getting the move done on Malvin, I believe. Yeah. Harvey's dropped back a bit ever since he took the position. Maybe he felt bad. I don't know, though, because Callum's also got him. Otto? He's got DRS on Leonardo. He's very close. Hello, he's got around the outside Oscar. of Matthew Bailey. Oh, oh! He makes the move. As you saw, he's got a purple sector too as well. Good exit from the chicane. He's going to have DRS. And he's going to be going to be racing away from Matthew Bailey at this point. He's going to want to try gapping a bit more because Matthew Bailey will have the double DRS. Very interesting. A lot of positions swapping, except from Luke Mills, obviously, because he's just gone, hasn't he? I think it might be a Luke Mills sprint win already. I don't want to get too confident about it, but he, he's looking like he's gone. But Otto. Otto. Yeah. Yeah. He gets the move done under DRS. Very good from him. He's, he's on the back of Leonardo for pretty much the whole lap, and he's just waiting for that DRS to get away. And Have you Bailey done the inside of Bello? Oh, yes, he, he does. Get it done? Yes, he does, but in the braking zone. Yeah. Not even on DRS, he just broke a bit later. Or did Bello break earlier to get the switch back? We will never know. He Ayan. tried to switch back, but there wasn't room for him. Mm. Ayan's very close now. You get What, what penalties does he have? Oh, as he goes off track a bit, though. Ooh. Well, I've got a warning for that. He has five seconds of penalties, so at this point, he's... um. I think he's he's quite far back now. Oh, he didn't get a warning for that. Oh, the bellow got away with the one position now. on the DRS straight. With a, obviously double DRS. Yeah, it is a double DRS back here. But he can't get away. Oh, Vilius is around. He's in the gravel trap at the exit of the chicane. Oh, oh with Melvin's oh, out. Melvin in the oh, wall. Bad. He bad. is in the wall there. Bad. I think that might have been... And that is another safety car. Yeah, I think it's going to be in a safety car. That'll be out for one lap. lap. Yeah, it will be out for one lap. But I think that's... Uh, had to be Villius and Malvin colliding. But were they close? Or was it um, maybe Villius... Think... Maybe Villius spun and it made Malvin do something and then he just cur yeah, accidentally went to the wall. Is anyone pitting, though? Yeah, Timo's yeah. pitting. Roger and Timo. Oh, I was pressing F6. I was just constantly going in and out of, of uh, the uh, teapot cam on um, on the Mercedes of Otto. Um, but yeah, Rodfall also pits for soft. This is not good for Arjun as he has five seconds out mm, up and down no, severely. I, I think now Arjun's going to be, he's going to be moving back to like, I reckon he could be out of Pete. He could be out, out of... He might be at the point. I reckon be out of the points. I, I, oh, actually, I don't know. The points only go down to P8, and mm. other than Oscar over three seconds, nobody else has a penalty. So he's yeah. gonna have to pull a gap, which means avoiding fighting. The sprint race is like one of the. It's just the one race where you just don't, you don't want to get penalties. But it, it could be like. Alvin said he had no grip, and that's how he crashed. Oh, unfortunate. Marco said David Hoy washed. Don't know about that Ooh. one, mate. He's in the points. You're on F2 driver, so I wouldn't get a bit. I wouldn't get too loud. But yeah, we're going to be restarting. Luke Mills is going to take the restart as he's leading. Emo alongside Dino. Oh, is he? No, he's backed off now. But yeah. that was very a bit cheeky. Side. And Rodwell's trying out on him. Why? That just gets you a penalty, man. Anyway, do you reckon Bello could now use the safety car to his advantage and get the win? Maybe even Mappy Bailey. Maybe could even do. Otto. Maybe even Aryan if he managed to get in front and run away that quickly. Interestingly, Callum doesn't have fully RS. Has he not saved it? I think Lou Mills has gone, by the way. Lou Mills has gone. He is going. It's go, go, go. Green Bello flags. Bello's doing a lot better this one. Yeah, green flag racing Bello. Yeah, as you said, he has, he's stayed with Luke Mills, and he could be on for a sprint win. We'll see as there's, this is the penultimate lap. Can he get it done? Yep. He needs to ideally, well, because it's not going to be DRS, is there? No, there will not. He just needs to stay close. 
and just make sure he absolutely saves a bit of ERS for the last lap so he can just drain it. Matthew Bailey, though, is also very close on the back of Bello. Last time I said that, that was a crash. Well, all Jim would want to be, but... Mm. Mm. Oscar in a similar situation, except much lower chance to get points. Yeah. Unfortunately for him, he was quite quick last race. Oh! Yeah, Matthew Bailey takes the position! Alfie Harvey and Matthew Bailey past Bello. Yeah. Go through the chicane, but will... Matthew's got less ERS. He's kind of just dumped it. Oh, and Bello oh, spawned! Oh, no! That's not good. And now Oscar's going to get him as well. That's so unfortunate, you know. Yep. There's Callum to the outside yeah, of Timo. Yeah, on Timo. But no, Timo still... Timo's got him. Yeah, he, he's going to keep it. He's going to get the he's gonna get the position over Callum. Well, that's, that is... I feel really bad because, you know, he's... In the previous races, he's been unfortunate with some DNFs. And he's not been up there, up there. But he was up there, up there this race. And he's just... He span out. Yeah. Oh, Arjun is one morning away from getting another penalty. Marco, don't say things like that, mate. All right. What's he said? He said said that when he was in the pits. Are oh, you you are slow, long. Cheers, mate. But I'm not. Uh. Got yellows. That is mm. Dino. But, oh, Callum's very close to Roswell. This could be for points. It's this very much. Oh, very, oh and there's Timo's Bello. gone. No, Timo, 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 not Bella. Oh, what's happened there? What Is has he, happened you there? He's gone on the grass. He had to have. Bello gets him. Why's Bello back there? What happened to Bello? He spun. Yeah, but didn't he? And just, then did he not again. Re I think he must have spun again because he was. He was Wait, only like I think he, those two might have had something together. Oh, maybe. Drop back together. But Callum's in points. Callum's gonna get good points. Maybe. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's the end of the race. Right. As Cannibal goes into P6, uh, it's good. But Luke Mill's winning yes. it. Matthew Bailey, Does P2. Get anything? No, he's down to 10. Damn. That's, that's unfortunate. Bello stays 12 as he destroys his car. Dino 13 and Timo. Yeah. Eventually. Crossing the line. Oh, yeah. Well, Otto in P3, you know, Leo in 4, Roswell P5. Unfortunate for some drivers like Bello. Yep. You know, it's he was up there. Obviously, driver of the day goes to Roswell on this sprint race. Had all right, did all right. I think he got points, didn't he? Yeah, he did. But yep. Yeah, very unfortunate. Bello, he was up there and he just had a bit of a mistake. Right, this is this is a sprint. Results and it's going to be your grid for the race. Luke Mills P1, Matthew Bailey P2, Otto P3, Leonardo P4, Roswell P5, Alum P6, David Hoy P7, Alfie Alvi P8, Vilius P9, Arjen P10, Oscar P11, Bello P12, Dino P13, Timo P14, Malvin P15, and Twan rounding off the the uh the grid in p16 well race director oh dear and i missed it i don't think anyone's gonna get it's right it's raining it's raining um i'm assuming raining. no one's gonna get it's gonna try and get the only panel is that he's gonna get removed is the probably the illegal overtaking but like you don't need race director for that you only need race director for corner cone yeah. I doubt anyone's going to get corner cutting penalties removed because if you cut a corner, mate, you've cut the corner. Um, Let's just pray. I'll get the one for the main race, though. The two Red Bull fans are still very excited. Yeah. One is still very pleased with that post. Oh, it's a bit lighter in there. It seems like they've got two chairs and just a bench. Are yep. they prisoners? Are they? Genuinely? Uh, um, maybe. I think they might be captives. I, I do still wonder what the Ferrari one's cheering about. Yeah, yeah. He's not actually facing the... 
he, back. He's cheering his team. He's cheering the guy in the back on because he's digging out of that bloody cell. Or maybe he just really loves the post inside the room. He might have really like the column. But anyway, one, two, three, four, five red lights. Lights out. We are racing in Australia with Luke Mills getting a good start ahead of Matthew Bailey. Two attempts ahead, but there's lots of carnage. I'm going to look back here because you never know. Lots of things can happen. Oh, and people going wide. People going everywhere. A bit of a frame drop because there's so much spray in one confined area. And there's so much carnage. We've got people going side by side. The outside, no. We've got people oh, going they both just wide. There's touching Otto, everything. Oh, we've got Bello round. Bello is round. I think he's back there now. Oscar is all oh, twins to get three second time power. We got David Oi going wide. Oscar being That's involved in that battle. Somebody. Yeah, That's Alfie Harvey round. He's 15th now. I think he's got somebody no front wing. Down it's, the front wing, and I think, I think it's it Alfie Harvey. Alfie. Let's look. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. Unfortunate start for him, but it's been a bit of an exciting start. Another repeat of the sprint with people going, thinking they can win the race into turn one. Alum up to fourth from six. Ooh. He's already up two. Um, we got Oscar up five. Yes, Team yes, we do. Juan both up four. And obviously, the biggest loser would be Alfie Harvey with. Everything that's gone on, but he'll probably have to pay it. Hmm. That's a good example from Callum there. You keep within the lines and you're going to get positions if you don't do anything crazy. I think that's what he's done. And he's up into P4. It's good from him so far. So it's also good from his team at Bailey and Luke Mills and Otto. Keeping their positions. They did get away from the pack to be Drive fair, quite well. Villiers. Oh dear. We've got a couple of drivers in. we got three in. Getting for what? Oh, new wing, probably. Yeah. Yep, Timo, new wing. Everyone, new wing. Didn't yeah. really look like Twan needed one, but he is getting one. I think he might have lost an end plate. Or maybe he's got slight damage, he just wants to get oh, that Oh, Matthew Bailey ran outside Luke. He can't get it done. They drift off the track. Was it only a VSC? I thought it was a full safety car. I forgot. No, it was a VSC. It, just, it was a debris. I was looking at... I was looking back at the Donnies. Cause I thought... Anyway, it doesn't matter. The man at the village, obviously, will drive through. We got Aryan. Getting the move done on Roswell. Oscar passed David Hoy very quickly on that restart. He's mm. now looking at Callum. Oh, Alfie Harvey! He's out. He's out at turn and one. Safety car. Who's ahead between Callum and... Uh, Matthew Bailey's in the lead. Matthew Bailey has taken the lead of the race. We didn't see that, but... Alfie Harvey said he did want us to, you know, roast him a bit. But, mate, you've DNF. How would you do that at turn one? You're probably not even racing so anyone, mate. Yeah, mate, honestly, just don't spin, in it. Just maybe, like, be a bit more careful. Don't have a lead foot. How would you do that, man? You're not even battling anyone. I know it's raining, but I mean, it's only a bit damp. Come on, man. Anyway. Um... Clear up, and with the amount of virtual safety cars we're getting, that will be a lot sooner than expected. Yeah. This is very good. I mean, Billius, can he serve a driver under VSC? Uh, not under virtual, no. Is he going to try? No, he knows. He knows. No. That's unfortunate for him, to be fair. Yeah, we've got Rodwell in. Oh. Again. New no, not again. It was Twan. Oh, Matthew Bailey drove for it. Oh, oh, oh. He's gone too eager. He hasn't left him enough Roswell time. He doesn't have a front wing. He is getting a full oh, there. Yep. Okay. Well, Matthew, yeah, Bailey, Matthew Bailey is, uh... As he's down, Ooh, he's going to be losing a lot of positions there. So Luke Mills... Oscar is looking to racy today, though. Mm. Sprint race. He wasn't this racy, but now he, he's he's running rampant. He's very close to Callum. You reckon he'll get the move done, I reckon. I reckon he will. Try. He's, up, he's up six, maybe seven at the end of the straight and he, position. And he is. I think he's start. using. I think he's using. Yes, he, he is. is around the, uh, down the inside. Down sorry. the inside. And, oh, I think a bit, maybe a bit wobbly there from Callum. But he he loses the position to Oscar, who is going on a charge for that front three, isn't he? Gets it done. Yeah, he is now up. What was that seven positions? Seven positions. Now? He is charging. Callum, though, he's still there. He's not lost. He's not disappeared. 
he is still there behind Oscar. That is really impressive, though, seeing as we've had pretty much three laps at this yeah. point. And, well, you no know, reason. probably half of that under VSC, Matthew Bailey serving his drive through. That is... I'm going to get five feeds. seconds. No, he's good with that. He, no, at least he would done speed. That's uh, so that being thrown around here as this is pretty much the f one, the first full racing lap. Pretty yep. sure. Yeah. Unfortunate for Matthew, but hey, you know, maybe just don't speed under VSC. That is the easiest way to easiest thing avoid to that penalty. Yeah, maybe just give yourself a bit, maybe a second or two, not five tenths. Oh, we do that, that puts Oscar up onto the podium. On the podium. He had a bit of a slip, I think. I don't know. But he's gaining a lot of time to Osso. Gaining a right lot of... Callum. Yeah. Oh, my God. The ABC sponsored by GRS David Hoy is very close to Callum now. On the back straight using ERS. Is he going to get the move done into the chicane? He's going to go around the outside. Crazy, crazy man. Is he going to do it? I think he is. He's going to keep it there. Oh, but Callum keeps the inside right, line and defends well. And yet, uh, David Hoy backs out. Has a bit of a slip on the exit there, but stays with Callum. Oscar, he's lost a bit of time to Otto, but he's going to want to gain it back to the ABC sponsored by GRS driver. Um, uh, as David Hoy, he's still very close to uh, Callum. He's probably going to want to get that done on the pitch straight. Although Leo and Arjun are now closing up with them. Mm, they are. They're getting very close now. Uh, Bello. Bello, right on yeah. the back of Malvin. Of Malvin. He's getting very... Oh, a bit of a slip. A I bit of a slip. He keeps slipping. He's not liking the wet weather, is he? Not many drivers are, to be fair. But some are still coping better than others. As we have David Hoy losing a bit of time to Callum there. I wonder if Callum's used DRS. I don't know. But he seems to be doing well in the Inter's conditions so far. Keeping David Hoy behind. And it doesn't seem like he's having any internet problems. Fastest lap. Hope I haven't jinxed him there. Timo, yeah, get in the fastest lap. He wants to get some points from this race and he could still be in it. There could be a safety car. You know what F1's like. It's actually probably, I want to say it, probably the dirtiest tier in the league. I mean, certainly a lot with of the amount of DSCs we've had already, it's... Looking like it. It's not been very clean racing, though the no. rain hasn't helped with that. But even in the dry, you saw in the sprint, they were all just trying to win the race into the first corner, if you know what I mean. Maybe not the front, yeah. maybe not the front runners, but I mean certainly it's when you get to the mid pack, they were all just biting at each other's tires. Crazy. Aggressive. It's like you've got a bunch of Mike Tysons driving F1 cars. Oh now. Bello is very close behind Malvin. He's two tenths he's raining. within two. Yes. Oh, it has. Good observation there from Charlie. It has stopped raining. We'll be driving on a dry track within probably. Has to be within at least Depending ten laps. Quick hit dries, yeah. I mean, bit of a line starting to form now. Mm, you, you can, can see, see it. The... Actually, trying very quickly. Yeah. Go on board. It is Australia. Yeah. On board with Malvin. Very okay, no. Timo getting fast up again. He's he's speeding. Oscar uh, now quite close to Otto. Mm. Gain that time. He then wants what to would get be DRS. Yeah, he wants to get that P2 position from the ABC sponsored by GRS Otto. He wants that position. Um. <laughs> On the back straight, not even using ERS, he's just oh, got that pace. Oh, David Hoy down yeah, the yeah. of Callum. We've seen that, and he... Oh, oh Callum still stays there, though. And, ooh, a bit of argy-bargy, maybe, but I think he gets it actually clean. I think Callum has got the move there, clean. And we've, and we've also the got... Outside. Yeah. He oh, the again. from the outside. Oh, he's sliding, oh, slip and slide. Doesn't get the move done. The man to keep it out of Leo's side pods. But oh, certainly. Bello and Malvin. Bello and, the outside of Malvin. Oh my He's god. Got it done. A lot of battling now on lap six as the track is drying up. And he speeds. He's got to get him. past these two quickly. Yeah. He want, going to want to make light it. work. And he. Oh! Uh, Malvin, uh, Malvin, is he you ready? He's gambling for the dry tyres. I reckon he must be. I'll have a look. But we um. have. 
Matthew Bailey is going to be fighting with Bello. Have... He's doing a wing yeah, change, but he has put the mediums on. Fair enough. Yeah, to be fair, actually, mediums probably are the right call. But Matthew Bailey, he's going to want to get past Bello now. But as we know, Bello, he is quick. He's just unfortunately back here due to his uh, unfortunate mishap in the sprint. But we do know he can race Matthew Bailey and he can stay ahead of him. Will Matthew Bailey make light work of him, get past? But DRS spin enabled. DRS enabled. This could be a really good time to pit for Malvin. Malvin might have just had, yeah. like... Oh, my God. We'll have to see if anybody else pits. Yeah. Surely. It still looks pretty damp out there. There's a lot of spray, but... But, like, um, it is those In the mid-pack, like Bello, it might be worth taking the risk. Like, Dino what? might have a look. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna quickly look if. Oh, Matt. Oh, Bello, works. very close. No, he didn't get it. Matthew Billy does overtake him eventually. Oh Luke yes, they're pitting. In the top three are all in. Will Matthew Billy go into the pits as well? Yes, he will. will. No. David Hoy won't though. Uh, doesn't want to stack. He doesn't want to stack. And no, Leo doesn't uh, go in. Leo's out as well. Iron goes in. Matthew Bailey. Uh, Callum in. gets a five seconds for speed. Oh, Callum, Callum, Callum. Stop getting Dino the in. But David Hoy obviously going to lead the race with Leonardo, but I think most people are surely are going to be pitting. Malvin could be looking very good here. Let's see. He's going to Both pit. Alfa Romeo's pit. They take oh, he's chance. definitely getting positions here. Coming around the final corner. He's he's actually looking... The track's looking very dry now. And... He's... He moves up to P11, just outside of the so points. One position where he was, behind where he was, sorry. Yeah. But he has warm tyres, so... Might we'll be able see. to gain a bit up here. David Hoy and Leonardo. On a pretty much completely dry track now. Leonardo and David are going to be struggling for grip. Yeah, and they are going to... When they pit, they're probably going to lose a lot of position. They're losing time. Yeah. It's actually, they're gaining on Luke. They are actually. Maybe it wasn't the time. Interesting. Oh! Oh, they're battling, oh, that's why. Oh, they're battling! And oh! Otto! Otto! Is he gonna get him? He's, he DRS. might go. DRS is gonna go down the inside! No, he won't. So he'll oh, stick he will stick it behind. Oh, very late. He's gonna stick it behind and just. Stay sensible. But yeah, uh, David Hoy and Leonardo are pitting now. They will lose a lot of position further. Yeah, I don't know why Leonardo didn't fit. Probably should have. Yeah, he had the choice to. Maybe to try and get those mediums to go to the end. Hmm, possibly. It's unlikely, but... Everyone moves back up into their original position. Wait, uh, David Toy is in Wait, fourth. Has he jumped Callum here? Oh, oh not right, no, but... not about... Not... But he has... It hasn't he's... affected him too badly. He's got hards as well. His tyres are going to be lovely yeah. at the end of the race. He gets a lot of them have hard. Do they? Is there only a couple of tyres who've got mediums? Um, it's, it's a very That's even split, it. actually. It's Luke, uh, Luke, Oscar, Callum, David Hoy, Matthew, Dino, and Timo on the hards, and then everybody else on mediums. Yeah. So Otto is going to look to try and take the lead here, because he's Three very close. He's to the outside. Oh! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! He gets the move. He does it. Round the outside. DRS to... Beautiful, brilliant. Oscar's got the DRS on Luke Mills. We go aboard with him. Will he send something? No. Oh, it touched. Oh, very, he touches him. Touching. That could be damage. Contact. I don't. Well, well, something flew off. It he might have just been see. visual, though. It might have just been a bit of gravel. It might have been a bit of you know tarmac coming up. He's not pitting though, so I don't think he's got damage. Hasn't affected David Hoy and Leo very much there, although no. the cold tyres has not helped David. Otto He's down to seven. That. That Ayan is very close behind Callum now. He'll be looking for the move on the next DRS straight, probably. As Callum takes a bit of a centre, kind of centre line. Hello, fastest lap. Yeah. But here we go, Alfie Harvey with DRS down the inside on this second DRS straight. Oh, but touch it, a little bit of contact. But he did. Arjun's past Callum. Past him. Yeah. Arjun's past Callum. Yeah. When did that happen? I just said. Ah. Oh. I think she just commented. Oh, okay. That. Yeah, uh, anyway. I actually uh, wasn't listening. Dino. 
He close. He's close for the points. Melvin's in the points. Yeah, but he has the mediums. Who pick? As opposed Why to Dino's pick? hards. I'm so, I'm so confused there. Callum gets the some... iron back, by the way. Oh. Yeah, on that. He back does. Straight. Oh, David Hoy for Oh, seconds. dear. That's not going to be good for him. Especially when he's in a constructors fight with Luke right now. Well, yeah, with his teammate Luke. Oh, there's then. a... Uh, oh, Iron's right. He's out. And he's, he's retired on track. Has he? Yeah, he has retired on track. He's not out the race. His car's still moving. Range? That's naughty. Can't do that. Not allowed to do that. Is he raged? Or is he disconnected and it's just not showing? By the looks of it, he is off the track, so there probably won't be a safety yeah. car. Yeah. Well, but keep an, no, keep an eye on F1 chat just to make sure that he's done it for a reason. See. He did leave very quickly after, but I'm not sure if that's... That's his third DNF, you know. Or fourth. He hasn't finished the race yet. That's unfortunate for him. What's the penalty for retiring on track? I actually don't know because I don't usually do that. I'm not looking out for it, to be honest. Yeah. Luke Mills on Otto. Whoa. Down the inside. Uh, round the outside. Using sorry. the DRS. Yeah. Round the outside. Using that DRS to his advantage. He's going to have a DRS now. And, oh, Oscar might be able to get a move because he's going to have DRS on Otto. Not going to use DRS, so he's saving DRS. I don't think. I think he'll stay behind Otto for now. He's going to be looking. For that move later on in the race when maybe the tyres are dropping off a bit. He's got hards, Otto's got mediums. So he's just gonna stick out behind him, I reckon. This way F1 manager, this would be the point of the race where I stick on 16 times. There's not many people are close, but never mind, Otto is very close behind. Leo grabs fastest lap. But Otto, yeah, very close behind Luke Mills. Is he going to hard claim the position? Go around the... No. Yeah, the hards are looking... The hards are looking nice looking right racy. now. They're looking very nice. Ooh. Callum's gained a bit of time to Leonardo here. Has Leonardo got Callum? I can't... Oh, David Hoy goes wide on the exit of the chicane. Nearly getting a bit of understeer, probably... Touch the inside curb. Not good to touch that curb again. I don't know why people do. It's yeah, I've caught back up the Callum. Yeah, he has. Oh, and Luke Mills Sorry. is getting... Oh, is Oscar going to get Luke Mills? Oh, he does. Yes. Down the inside. He's just been done. Yeah, Luke Mills is in positions, but I think he might just be saving the RS. I don't know. But he has yeah. less than Oscar and about the same mm. as Otto. So. Mm. But he's also in his hard tyres. And, uh... Yeah. Ironically, so very... Same as Oscar, though. Yeah, yeah. Very, very similar, um, you know, letters before their names. Hmm. I wonder what's going on there. I'm joking. Uh, it's probably nothing. David Hoy. He's close to Callum. He's getting the time back very after his mishap. Very close the top three. Yeah, I know. He's very close. Otto! Oh, Otto, three seconds. Three seconds. No, that is ruined. If anybody else has any warnings in that. That's ruined. Yeah. Twan went on an absolute session of getting them on that one. <laughs> he got, what's that, ten in a row? Oh, Hang on, blimey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in a row. Reiki, man. Um, yeah. Uh, and then, right, so, Oscar has one. Yeah. Uh, hang on. See if we've got any more. Oh, I sorry. Trying to interrupt, but Oscar gets Otto on the sh on the back straight with DRS. You can carry on now. Oh, Oscar has one and Luke has zero, so okay. it's not looking like penalties are going to be a. But Luke is still. For those two. Luke is still the one in the favour so far. If they do carry on with their corner cut uh, off track antics. Although it doesn't look like. It probably won't. Oscar will. That's so unfortunate, you know, that like Cam's got five seconds there, because he's having an, he's actually having one of like his better performances in the season, but he's just gonna drop back. Unless it's a safety yeah. car. When he can where he can serve it. But right now it's not looking like people are close enough together to cause one, maybe except from the top three. And you've also got to say Matthew Bailey ever since that driver has been pretty stagnant. Yeah. He's yeah, not he moved. Hasn't really gone anywhere. 
He stayed there. He was on the hards, but yeah. At this point, they'll at this point starting he's starting to get quicker. He probably, but he probably still won't even get. Like, there's like at least there's four people ahead of him on the hard tires. You know, maybe you yeah. can not count Callum because he would probably let him pass. But in the rest of it, oh, Bello's disconnected. Bello's left. I think Do he's I just disconnected. Him? I don't know. But like. Yeah, Matthew's not, not looking good right now. That's all I'm saying. He's not looking. He's looking good for a, a, another maybe P4, P5 position as he's been getting recently. But been very unfortunate. But Oscar does lose position to Otto going into the off the after the uh, the fourth and final DRS straight of the lap. I wish I saw that. That might have been a good move. But David Hoy is very close to Callum. He's very. He's gained a lot of time for him now. He's within. Four tenths. Now the DRS. I think Callum's lost the DRS. No, he's still got it. He has still got it. Just about. But he's losing time to Leonardo now. Hey, you Bailey through the ghosted Bello. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Bello. Again, he's he's been having a decent. He, he was having decent pace, but he's just been unfortunate with that you know disconnection and such. Russell's still going on for ninth between Dino and Malvin. Yeah. And Has also... Been for a while now. Ooh. Oh, to the outside. Yes, Dino goes around the outside and... He's got it done. No, so he's very, he very, very deep. He locked up. He locked the, the rears a little bit and yeah. He's gone, as you said, he's gone very... He went very deep. But... So, oh, Twan! Hello. He's out. Turn one. Twan out. A safety car. This is perfect for Callum. He can serve that five. Yeah. And oh, there's a bit of position oh, jockey in. I think maybe uh, maybe David Hoy was ahead. Maybe Callum overtook as it came out and had to yeah. go it back. Yeah, possible, possible. But that is very big. One. That's also quite good for Bello, although mm. while he can't take control until it's over, it does stop him from losing positions till he's back in. It does, unless his AI hits him. Which is a possibility. Uh, yeah, David Hoy going into the pits. Callum also going into the pits. Don't speed, Callum. Don't speed. Slow. No, he Break. is very... Break. Very Good. slow. Huh? Good. Good, Callum. The leaders also pit him. Ferrari's Oh, there. is he double stack? Is he going to be a double stack? Matthew's going to double stack. Matthew's double stacked. He's gonna get held up. Oh, with the five oh, seconds. Oh, oh no! Oh dear, he's gonna get jumped. I think by Bello. He's been jumped by Bello's AI. He's been jumped by Bello's AI. He's been jumped by Malvin. He's been jumped by Dino. He's been jumped by Timo. Oh dear! A lot of positions gone now. That is Otto on softs. That is brave. Oh, on softs. But you gotta say. That is a Williams disaster class in strategy right there, yeah. isn't it? If I was Matthew, I'd just go for a track position. Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, the, um, the eight warnings for uh, Twan appear to have all come from the same corner. Oh. There must have been lap one instant. Has to be. Yeah. But, got to say, Twan DNF is... at turn one. That's... Yeah. He's done a proper Alfie Arby there, hasn't he? It's not good for him, but it's helped a couple. Especially those who are looking bad on tyres and fuel. Yeah. But. Who's, we got um, Timo under fuel, and it looks like it, uh, uh, Vilius under fuel for that. Looks yeah, like it's to, just it. You have to take advantage of the uh, safety car then. Putting in lean mode. Roswell's. They're all on lean, I'm pretty sure. Well, not all of them. I wouldn't be surprised. Few of them will. Definitely Villiers. He has to be on lean. Very unfortunate. I just realised both Red Bulls out. Very bad for the constructors. Not been consistent enough, yeah. you could say. Maybe they need to just practice on up in their consistency, you know. This. Did yeah. I say that right? Did I say that properly? Consistency. Yeah. Yeah, consistency. That's the word. Yeah. yeah. That is a word. It is in the English. Big mix of tyres. A lot of 
a lot of mediums softs. and oh, no. hard. Two Only two softs. Two softs. A lot. Although of... that is weird. A lot of mediums. And softs few is quite a strange tire to go on. Mediums are definitely the better tire. Um, obviously the medium runners probably have to go on hard tires. It's probably the only other tire they had. But would it be better yeah. to go on the softs? If you're on the mediums. It's a long way to go on softs. It is. We'll see. Well, 12 we'll laps see. is a stint. We'll see what they make of it. I'd expect safety car in this lap, to be fair. Yeah, everybody's caught up. What to talk about? Oh! Uh, football's probably kicked off by now, hasn't it? Yes, it will have done. Well, I'm going to get that score up on my phone. Let's have a look at Luton Town. 2-0 down to Arsenal. Yes! Oh, Who scored? Has Declan Rice scored or has he assisted? Odegaard and... Uh, I can't actually see the other one. It hasn't come up for some okay. reason. Okay. Well... Lovely. Safety car in this lap, by the way. Safety car in this lap. In this lap. Um, Luke Mills. Oh, sorry, just done nothing. Okay. Yeah, oh dear. But yeah, safety car in. Let's see. As Luke Mills, obviously, once again, leading his safety car. Oscar doing a bit of cheeky alongside there. Can't do that, mate. Calm down. Back off a little bit. Good there. There you go. Done the right thing. Let's see. Otto's going to go for track position or just tyre saving? With that penalty, he's got to go for track position. And Luke Mill goes. He's gone. Went early. Oscar very off guard, but mm. Otto was ready for it. I mean, Oscar was off the line. Yeah. He expected him to go later. I think Luke Mills just wanted to catch people out guard, off guard, as he did. No, he's caught right back up to Luke. We've got Tebow games right on the back of Dino. Nothing happens, but Matthew Bailey also back there. Unfortunate due to, uh, you know, oh, um, double stack. Oh, Dino past Dino. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. and that's and Matthew, Matthew Bailey. Bailey. Look on him. Over Dino as well. Both drivers Dino taking advantage two of the Alpine. In one. Yeah, take, both drivers taking advantage of the Alpine there. Overtaking him. And that's unfortunate for him, but I reckon he'll be able to fight his way back in the points. Hopefully. You, you'd want to you want to hope for him. But yeah. he knows oh, a lot of three seconds. seconds. That is, as I say, oh, right. We're now on four drivers. No, five drivers. Mm. I'm sorry. I think I might have just given him commentator's curse. You know, I said that he might be able to get back on the points, and then he gets that three seconds. And Roswell to the inside. Oh, Otto Oscar. does get it done with ERS. Obviously, DRS not going to be activated until after the next lap, I believe. Roswell, very close behind Dino. Mappy Bailey battling with Timo Games. Swapping positions side by side. Timo's still there. He's going to go up Neither the inside of the out. penultimate corner. Oh, Mappy very, very late. close. Late on the brakes from Mappy Bailey. And they're still side by side. They're still side by side going up the straight. And I think Timo might have him. We'll have to see. They were totally fast as down, down the inside from Mappy Bailey. Is he going to get the move done? Timo's still there. Timo's still there and he keeps it there and he gets ahead. Oh my god, what are we seeing, Charlie? Oh, Matthew Bailey down the inside. And down the inside, but oh, he gets stuck all the time. Timo's it. still there. What is this from Timo Games? You know what? Brilliant defense. I think he's in a. I think he might be speaking with Oscar here. He might, he might are. be doing this for Oscar. He might be defending Matthew Bailey so he can't get back up. The podium. It is a brilliant defence, though. It is. It's wonderful defence from Timo. Roger, I'll try and oh. have a look on Dino while he's at it, though. Oh, he is. Is that Matthew Bailey around the outside? Oh, yes, they're still. No, they're still. Oh, they touch. Oh, and the Dino's round as well. Timo. Oh, dear. I wonder what's happened that there. Looks, Could that be that a. Looks dangerous. Do you reckon that's either a mess up from Timo or a mess up from Matt? It looks just like trying to get two cars into the same corner and mm. it just neither left enough room and That's unfortunate because Timo was de was depending so well until that. We'll have to wait and yeah, see though. It's not... But Callum Very close behind David Hoy. Obviously got getting rid of his penalty. He could be in for good points here, Charlie. He could be in for a P four, maybe yeah. even a podium. 
We'll have to see. It will be his first podium in GRS. And it'd be a great way to do it after... What do you have to say? He was in mid-pack at one point with a penalty. And you'd think he'd be down on his luck. But he seems to be right back in it. Oh. Oh, as we say that, I've given him the commentator's three curse. Seconds, I've right given there. him the commentator's curse, and he's got three seconds. What is it with me and Oscar? Oscar back past Austin. Yeah, gets past, but back. Oh, why have I. Loop? No, he won't get. Oh, maybe. Not DRS. On the next track. Oh, oh, not like that, he won't. Slip and slide. It's, it's still a bit damp, Charlie. I'm joking. It's probably not. It's quite dry. But the traction. Oh, Villiers God. getting a penalty. Malvin on Matthew Bailey. Is oh. he going to. Here we no, go. He doesn't, but... I love see. I love seeing these these mid pack members fighting. Neither Matthew Bailey. Have any RS at mm, all. Matthew Bailey's wasted that all fighting team, though, hasn't he? he has to yeah, have... but it looks. So... Oshrod's looking good for points, you know. Oscar de getting fastest lap, one eighty nine. On the medium tyres. He was very close to Luke. A late safety car. Modwell's looking really good. Oh, he is. That's very unfortunate for Callum, you know. I've given him the commentator's yeah. curse. I said he could be in for a podium. Gets a three-second time penalty. Uh, so, pretty much, right, if you're a, a driver in F1, if you're watching this back, just pray that you don't do anything that notable that I say you could be doing well here, because I might just get you a, a, a time penalty, because, of, you know... Well, David Toy runs good. off track. Now Callum's going to have a look around the outside. Oh, he's going he's gonna to use this to advantage and... Yep. Turns back gets around. To the end. Oh, and he gets he has got he's got him. And done. that is crucial because they both got three seconds. You know, he's gonna be wanting to uh stay ahead. Him, so somebody who doesn't who's right behind him is Bello. He wants to get past him. Well maybe he doesn't. Maybe he could just... Oh! Ooh, down oh down the does. inside! He does want to get past him. He's going for moves, he's slipping a bit. Is he gonna stake it on the inside here? Yes he is, he lets him go though. He does let him go. But Bello, you know what? He's had a bit of a, a comeback after disconnecting the sun. Yeah, bit of a resurgence. Malvin not letting Matthew Bailey go, though. He's sticking with him. Mm, he is still in that DRS. He's gaining now. And obviously, he's still going to have DRS on the next straight with the double DRS zone. They love double DRS in not Australia. Not sure he wants oh. to overtake him. I think it's more he wants to go with him. He just had a bit of a slip there. Went off track yeah. slightly. I don't think he got a warning. Not though. ideal, but Otto is still very close. Either the, the front, the front three, the front three are just very close, man. It's yeah. super close. Callum is very close to Leonardo Torissi. Leonardo Torissi can have a podium. What is happening? I don't know. It's chaos. It's confusing. It's discombobulating in F1 today. Loads of penalties, loads of possible podium points, positions given out to drivers because of these penalties. But Bello is... Oh, oh, whoa. Yes, he does. He does. He, he go Yes. And now he's going to be wanting yeah. to gain on Otto because he wants to get in ahead of him because obviously they've both got three seconds. Essentially, for them, their pe penalties are wiped. For them too. Maybe not for the rest of the drivers who don't have penalties, but for the the guys who have three seconds, everyone else who has three seconds, it, they, they, they're not there. Penalties aren't there for them. Oscar is getting very close to Luke now. He has to eventually go for a move. Maybe he's sticking it behind him and wait. Oh, Malvin's got another three seconds. Well, now he's got three seconds for the penalty runs. Uh, yeah. And Matthew Bailey is in the arse range of this train now. Ooh, he's back on the he's train. Headed by his teammate, so... Do you reckon we could see a, uh, a David Hoy defence to stop him from gaining time? Uh, it would be good for the constructors. It would. It really would. Yeah, Matthew is getting very close. I think he might Ooh, get better. Um, Leo. Leo. Leonardo. Trying that on Callum. Ran the outside. Oh, he... No, he clo Matthew Callum closes the door. Oh, but David's oh, David. Oh, David. It's all touching. Matthew Bailey's there as well, trying to get Bello. He's had to slow down a bit. Oh, that's unfortunate. And now Bello's going to look for a move. Oh, is he doing it? He's defending from Matthew Bailey. 
Oh, a lot of position swaps there. Oh, for. oh, oh uh, Leonardo takes advantage. He goes, and David Hoy still with Matthew Bailey. Matthew off track Bailey. A bit there. Is he going to get the move here, Matt? He's, oh, and he just pushed him Lloyd straight on track. That is oh, very tough. Yeah. And Melvin's brought right back into this, you know. Yeah, that is. Everyone behind. That's quite cheeky, to be honest. From Matthew Bailey, yeah. Yeah. Because he was within that, within that width. Oh, and Bellows lost it a bit. He's let. Oh, he's David Hoy's Hoy. gone, gone past him. Melvin, have a look as well. Is he gonna go down the inside of this? Oh, they touch. Oh, they touch. Oh dear. And all almost going into a Bellow, but keeps it under control. And I think Melvin's gonna get the move. He's gonna claim it from him. Oh, oh been a very up and down race for Bellow. You have to say he was up there at one point. Now he's down here. He's battling with these people. They've still got penalties. He's still going to get positions, but he's he's had a David bit Hoy's of David Hoy's going to try and get, get Matthew Bailey back here after that interesting piece of driving from gaining, him. Gaining the time back, using the DRS. I think he's got more ERS. Not much more, but he has got Hello, more. Hello, back past Melvin. Mm, he is. Oh, and Melvin's slipping oh, a bit in the background. Seems to keep Brilliant it under control, though. David Hoy's yeah. yeah, really good camera angle. As David Hoy, he's gained a lot of time. What, yes. what tyres is he on? Are they both on the same tyres? Um, yeah, they are. They are on the same tyres. Yeah, they are. They are, yeah. But he seems to be... Leo on the hard, so... Yeah. Leo might be able to get an advantage in the race, like maybe on the final two laps where their tyres might die. David Hoy, though, he's gaining time on these used tyres. He's clearly might be a bit better on old tyres and Matthew He goes off oh, track a little bit, but he track, keeps but... it under control. and doesn't. I don't think he's got a warning from that. He lost time. With the DRS open again, though, he's going to be wanting to gain that time back that he lost through that corner. Also, done really well to stay with him on them one softs. Hmm. Yeah, I, I told I told you he, he's class, mate. Otto can. He's out. He's outside the free. He might get a podium. Yeah. Oh my god. He's, he's looking good. Callum's lost. He's lost all that time. Obviously, he wouldn't get the podium anyway because he hasn't overtaken him. But that Leonardo needs to get past Callum. He needs to. He needs to get past him and get within that three seconds. He has been gaining a bit. But Matthew Bailey, he's close behind they Leonardo to back a lot. Yeah. Oh, and he makes the move down the inside. Will, will Leonardo try fight back, though, within the next few corners? Maybe on the next straight with the DRS? I wouldn't They're think he flashing. would. The, he had very little uh, defence there. Uh. Yeah, they are both flashing though. Maybe both he wants dead DRS. on that tree. Matthew Bailey using it to try and get away oh, wait. a bit there. Wait, what? Is the arrest not what? active? I'm looking at the wrong driver. That's why. I thought I was looking at Leo. On, I was not. I was looking at Matthew. Activating the DRS. Everyone right behind him. Good point for David Hoyt, but he needs to get rid of Bello. He needs to shake off Bello. He's still within that three-second time range. That's why he's just trying to sit with them for now. Mm, mm. Leo. Bello fighting with Malvin. Oh. Wait, something's happened there. Oh, it has. He's he's off track. And that... He's certainly been shaken off. And I think David Hoy, he could be in with a secure P7 here. Yeah, I mean... If he doesn't, if he stays there, he's got it. Got three seconds for taking avoiding action, now that might get removed. Hmm. What the David Hoy? Oh, you mean Bello? Lemanas. Lemanas. Villius. Villius. Yeah, yeah. That will probably be removed from avoiding action. He gets the move done on Malvin, as he. Roger it... trying to get past Bello. Oh yes, he is, and he does on DRS easy. Very will Bello give an answer? Will Will Bello give a reply? Reply? Sorry, no, he does not. But uh, this is looking a bit a bit pacey on those um on those soft tyres. the Williams will use team orders here. Huh? Mm, will they or I will? Think, I think they'll swap and Callum will do what um he told you to do and just hold them up. Yeah, yeah. But it's getting. You have flags. Hello. Yeah, that is hello on the main street. Spot, Unfortunately, looks, but... I think he's out of it now, isn't he? He's not even getting points. He's too far. That's the Williams games. swap. I must oh. have missed that. What? Yeah. Yeah, I, I missed that as well. Yeah. Well, anyway, Matt's got a lot of time to gain now in the next, in the final few laps. There's no ERS at all. No ERS. 
three seconds to the game. You know what? I that's why I'm a bit I'm a bit mad. I'm a bit infuriated because of this because Matthew Bailey just doesn't save his ERS ever. And that's actually one of the main reasons why he doesn't. And it Leo's get also more. out of ERS. Yeah, to be fair, but that's, that's the thing. When people don't save the ERS, it kind of infuriates me a bit because you know, at least save a bit save for your final lap. But you know what I mean? Because sometimes some drivers don't get positions because they lose all of their ERS and they just don't have yeah. any to gain, you know. Look, he's dropped back. He's lost time to Otto. If he keeps losing time at the Otto, uh, to Otto at this point, it might be a case of team orders. But we'll see. He's still, he's still draining. Penalty, so I doubt he'll give the position uh, back. He probably won't give the position back. He's still draining, though. Why is he still draining? Callum's not going to overtake him. He wants to gain into that penalty range. Yeah, he I... doesn't have a lot of time to do it. And Bellow gets a five-second penalty. Hello, so he's going to retire. Seconds. He's, he's going to retire in the Pertzing machine, mate. Either he's that close, or fast as back close, though. Roswell, very close on the back of, of uh, Malvin. He's still going to get points, but I think he just wants to have a bit of a fun battle here. But he needs to be careful. Bellow's going for fast as lap. Is he? Oh, is he not going to... Oh, he is. He could get that. Yeah, same with Dino as well. And Timo. We've seen them. They are... All very they are, Bello is Bello and Timo are very good. T Dino could also pull out something there. You know, Cam's getting very close to Matthew now. Matthew's losing loads of time. He's lost about two tenths since overtaking Gallum. Uh Rochwell gets Callum. past um Malvin by the way. Oh. I think Cal I mean, I think Math uh Callum he might Matt just ignore team orders and go for a move, fights you know. back and he's in the wall. Who, 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 who? Malvin, he was oh, being yeah. pulled by Rodwell there on the outside. Yeah, and he is, he's, he's definitely uh, affected by that because he's a bit he's a bit slippy. He was uh, His front end was going a bit on the exit of the corner. We'll see what he makes of it, though. Leonardo very close behind Callum now. Is Callum going to stick behind him or is he going to say sod it and go for a move? Be quite exciting if he went solid from go for a move, but it's the final lap, and he has three seconds. And he has three seconds. If he can only really pray Other that than Leo, Leo does, yeah, he, he's going down one position. He's getting a P6, and it's all right. And Matthew Bailey, he's not getting the podium unless you know dramatic oh, things Oh, Bello, happen. the three, three seconds. seconds. That does that mean he's not going like to get the, that? That won't get fast lap then. Oh, Lou, Oscar! No, Oscar takes it! Oscar, Lou Mills! They're so close, they're battling! Oh, I didn't know they were this close! Side by side. side by side, it's a final lap in Sector 3. I think Luke, he's backed out a bit there. I think Oscar's taken the lead. I think he's going to take the victory here. I don't, we don't That's know, though. Timo. Timo going very slow. Yeah, Timo going there? slowly, but... Oh, whip! Will Luke Mills, he touched... Oscar touched the grass, Luke Mills down the inside! Yes, rounds the final corner. I think he's going to take the victory here. He does. As Oscar Roger's touched out. the grass, Roswell's out. Oh my god, Luke Mills P1, Oscar P2, Otto P3 guaranteed. The penalties don't matter. Matthew Bailey P4, Callum P5, dropping down to P6. Leo going to get P5 eventually. David Hoy P7. Le Manas, really Villiers P8, uh, from, Malvin P9. Look, uh, from oh, Villiers Roswell. and Malvin. Roswell. That means Bello. Bello's going to get points. Bello's getting points after all. Yes. The trial and tribulations he's been through this race. He's going to get points after all. And actually, I'm going to... The real question though, who's getting fastest lap? Uh, can I put his lap data on? I don't think that... Oh, there we go. Let's look at this. Lap data is on. Last lap is 189. He does. Yeah, he does. He gets fastest lap. But will Timo? What's Timo or on? Dino? Or Dino? Actually, Dino gets fastest Dino lap. Dino fastest. takes it. But will T Timo, is Timo? He's, Timo he's up. Timo up on his best. Yeah, that's. I don't think that's a. That doesn't look like it's going to be enough. No. But he's pushing. He's, he's lost he's not fuel using as well. ERS, which is interesting. Though. Or is he saving it for the final straight? Yeah, he is. He's saving it for the final straight. And. Oh, he does! 18, he, does he, it. Gets it. he gets it! A 118 dead! Oh my god! That is a crazy, lap. crazy end to that. Plus, that goes to Timo. That singular point rescued for Alpha Tari. Oscar getting driver of the day. Who do we think our driver I think of the day is going to be? Enough. That's who I'd give it to. As yeah, well. yeah, to be fair. He, he came from like.
It Where? was like nine positions in the end or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, can you at Luke, Otto, and Oscar? Surprised Luke hasn't joined already. Should be used to it by now. Yeah, <laughs> he should be like he should just stay. He should like join at the beginning of the race. You know. Yeah. Because yeah, look at him getting his trophy. His usual P1 trophy. Final lap drama though. You know, Oscar. I think touching the grass, which affects his braking, and Luke goes through, takes the victory after it looked like Oscar was going to claim it. Very good. Also, very good for Motto to, even though he had the three seconds, he still had enough pace to get away from Matthew Bailey. And you know, unfortunately, it's it's Matthew Bailey finishing in in P4 once again. It's unfortunate. I'm going to make sure to get the instant. Incident. Here we go. Right. There you go, lads. That is the race director ran through. Bosh. Done it once. Don't need it again. Uh, but there, there we go. E1 for Luke Mills. P2 was for um... Oscar. And P3 for Otto. Belly once again missing out on a podium, unfortunately. He thought the stack probably wasn't what he wanted. Five seconds, Callum went in first with five seconds, and that unfortunately affected him quite a bit. Anyway, we've got interviews now. Ah, answer my question. Who, who, uh, Luke's joined. Oh, yeah. Um, is anyone else? Uh, is Oscar coming for an interview or not? Oh. Otto said he'll do it. Otto said. What about Oscar? Yep. Uh, he never does. Okay. Uh, we'll... we'll wait for Otto's reply. Right, yeah. Otto's joining Talking One if you want to drag him in. Please. Yeah, we will do. Why don't you just give commentators drag... drag... I have. It just doesn't work for some reason. Okay. No, it's just like being glitchy. I don't know what's wrong. I, was, I literally gave all the permissions possible for moving people and everything in the yeah. channel on the roll, everything, and it just don't, it just don't work. Oh uh, well, it's all right, I guess. Um, he's then talking, mom. He is okay. Yeah, I'll move him. Right, you got the level pair. Uh, Oscar is going to team does. Well, anyway, we'll start with you, Luke. Uh, very interesting race. It seems like top three were very close, constant battles, constant overtaking. And then final lap drama, you could say. Final couple of corners, penultimate corner. Oscar goes a bit wide and you take it from him. How do you feel about the whole race, really? How do you feel about it? Yeah, the race was good. Um, in those was an absolute nightmare at the start um i all i remember is turn three immediately breaking at the dry point half spinning and luckily no contact with anyone or anything so i got away with that one um i felt like when matt was on my outside then because i half spun kind of across his car he just couldn't mm. really overtake um and then yeah dried up quicker than expected it was like uh three uh things of rain yeah and but it and it went after like five laps. Uh, but yeah, then the tries were uh, tries were fine, and yeah, some good fights at the front once again. Um, mm. Pretty much a common theme every week now. Um, yeah. But yeah, good race. Very interesting. I also I don't know Charlie agrees with this. I commented on it. What considering you're the owner of the the of the of the GRS beautiful thing you've created, um, driving standards in F1 are a bit down so far what 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 are your opinions on like you know the multiple vscs and safety cars we got yeah round one and two we had like very clean races in those first two um and then all of a sudden i think people are getting a bit more into the season they putting fights on a lot more and going for uh, some aggressive maneuvers uh trying to fight for more and uh well yeah i don't know i mean just, uh Okay. Just mad, add some interest, uh, interest in strategy into the race, I guess. <laughs> yeah, uh, talking about your strategy, uh, obviously, y you saw it was going to be raining, and I'm assuming everyone's first reaction is, oh my god, you know, red, you're hating it, you don't want to race, 
but you have to. So obviously seeing the rain, what were you what were you thinking about strategy? If you knew it was going to dry up, what were you thinking? Well, uh, I thought it was going to dry up later, so I thought it was going to be in as the mediums, but because it dr dried up earlier, uh, it was pretty much a simple choice to go for hards because uh, you only had two sets of mediums. So by use if you'd boxed for mediums at that point, you wouldn't have a fresh one for a safety car, which came out again, which is why Otto would have had to go soft because I don't think he would have had uh, fresh mediums there. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, um, that was pretty much just the whole idea behind it. And uh, yeah, went pretty much how I expected it to in the end. Got yeah. very lucky uh, at the pit phase. I decided to dump all my battery, overtake both of them, and then the safety car came in like five seconds later, <laughs> which was uh, pretty pretty good timing. But yeah. yeah. And uh, one more thing, right? Obviously, Ferrari, uh, this, you're doing quite well. You're kind of bossing the uh, the constructors so far with David Hoy. Obviously, he finished P7, quite respectable. Um, one team a bit down there like this race, Williams. Um, I, I don't know if you heard about this, but uh, unfortunately under the safety car, there was a bit of double stacking, a bit of holding up, you know. Uh, so what would your like advice be to not just Williams? A lot of people, cause it, seems, it seems like you and David were quite well versed in camaraderie. What would, what would your advice be to uh, people when they're doing their strategy with their teammates and such, you know? Yeah, pretty much just... Uh... We we don't really discuss much other than like I, at the moment what would be the best thing to do. We pretty much just say what that would be. So, for example, on that safety car, we knew that he was quite close to me. So what I did is I pushed the delta so I could get into the pit lane, and he held back to sort of like a legal amount, not to take the piss, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Because obviously, if you take the piss, you get a penalty. <laughs> uh, so he did that just to make sure that he could get into the pit lane without losing any positions and just just little things like that to make sure. Yeah. You're not tripping over each other. Obviously, yeah. I know Callum and Mac do much because of um different wing change that happened for callum yeah yeah um, as well yeah in that scenario yeah, so five seconds and the five seconds oh was well, it that, five that, yeah yeah so that that did him that did him bad so basically don't panic and just communicate properly pretty much yeah that. pretty much well thank you very much luke uh and now otto you've Hello. had uh quite again yeah, eventful race battling a lot up the front but you managed to get the podium in the end especially with the three seconds. So, yeah, just give me your thoughts on the race. Uh, I thought it was an interesting race. You know, I didn't really expect to be at the front because I didn't practice very much in Australia. But uh, after the safety car box was soft because I didn't have the mediums, as people described, and I did a bit of an oopsie. But I managed to stay in the DRS and just pull out the three second gap and not fight too much because that would lose us too much time. Yeah. Quite nice. Um, but yeah, what, especially when you got the three seconds, what were you thinking when you did you just think, oh, that's it, you're not getting a podium, or would you still push on? You know, obviously, you did eventually get the podium. But what were you thinking when you initially got the three seconds? I mean, I knew the win was gone because I know Luke and Oscar don't get penalties very often, but I did think the podium was still possible. Yeah. And so I just tried to push on, not getting any more warnings. Quite good driving, to be fair, from you. And um, uh, Charlie, you want to ask any questions? Um, no, I don't think I've got anything to okay. ask. Well, uh, thank you, Otto, for coming to the interview. Thank you, Luke. And also, one more thing. Charlie pointed this out. I agreed with him. Today's driver of the day is going to be Oscar, considering that he managed to come back from... Where was he again, Charlie, on the grid? Um, for 11, for something? P10, P11, yeah, obviously down on luck in the sprint, getting down there. But came back, get the P2, almost race victory, but obviously, maybe, you know, hitting the grass on the brakes, going a bit wide. Luke taking advantage of that. But very, very good driving from Oscar. He gets the drive of the eight today, and uh, that wraps up Australia. So, uh, we will. What, what next? What track next week, Luke? Track. Uh, we got China. Oh, yes. Oh, we got the, the David uh, Hoy special. The David Hoy special. If no he doesn't one. win, he's not driving for Ferrari the rest of the season. That's what I've <laughs> determined. <laughs> everyone, everyone hates it except David Hoy. We will see uh, what happens because you know could be carnage. Uh, but yeah, that will be it for Australia, and we will see you for F one 
F2 and F3 next week in China. Goodbye.